This $3 billion tunnel was supposed to link Brazil to the world under the Atlantic Ocean. 2010s, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Budget, $3 billion. Planned, 5,800 kilometers undersea tunnel. The Rio Transatlantic Tunnel aimed to connect South America with Africa, promising high-speed rail and a new era of global trade. The vision, a submerged corridor from Rio de Janeiro to Luanda, Angola, using cutting-edge tunnel boring tech and supporting both freight and passenger trains. The idea captured imaginations, but reality hit hard. Political instability stalled decision-making. Brazil's shifting governments and economic crises made long-term commitments impossible. Engineers also faced daunting technical risks, seismic zones, extreme water pressure, and the sheer length, over three times longer than the Channel Tunnel. As costs ballooned and feasibility faded, international investors backed out. The project never broke ground. Today, only blueprints and a few promotional renderings remain. No tunnel, no tracks, just echoes of what could have been. The most concrete legacy? A 400-page feasibility study now gathering dust in a Rio archive. Status? Cancelled. Follow us for more unbuilt and unlucky.